All right, y'all, TCV, the country boy, coming back at you from Big D. As y'all know, my boss man done gave me the green light. He's like, go ahead, keep doing your videos. So I'm like, cool, I'm going to do that. And I want to let y'all know that if y'all personally know somebody who wants to get rid of a house that don't want to mess with it anymore, anywhere in the U.S., let me know. I'm also supposed to let y'all know that all these songs that I'm playing are not owned by me, are not copyrighted by me. I am only here to help promote this song and let y'all know that they are badass and y'all need to go and check them out. And if y'all want to do so, bam, this is a badass song. Go buy it. So that's what I'm here to do. If it's not badass, I'm not going to promote it. First of all, you ain't never going to see it. So everything that I do is going to be cool in one respect or another. So copyright people that own them. Don't flag me, man. Don't strike me. Don't do all that stuff, man. I'm doing it to promote songs and to people that don't know this stuff, man. Damn. Give me a break, man. Leave me alone. All right. Is that good enough for y'all? All right. Let's go on to some stuff. All right, y'all. Check this out, man. Somebody sent me a a version of Tupac, um, and it's got MC Hammer, Big Daddy Kane, um, Nutso, I don't know that one, and Danny Boy, um, don't know that one, I know MC Hammer, I know Big Daddy Kane, and I know, obviously, I know Tupac, I don't know these other guys, the song is called Too Late Playa, so, somebody sent this over and said, hey, you mentioned something about, um, Tupac being friends and hanging out, uh, with MC, uh, MC Hammer, and that MC Hammer was hard, he go, here, man, here's actually a song that they did, uh, kind of together, so, all right, that's cool, man, let's check it out, man, uh, I wonder if he put up them parachute pants for this, or, you know, or not, I don't know, I'm just saying, don't get all mad, I'm sorry. OG version, it says. Tupac Daddy, it ain't my fault that she's 
sprung on me And ain't it fun to make a gun put a tongue on me That's on the real, homie This is how it is when you play for keeps If your game ain't straight, you'll be delayed with me And after me, you'll probably fuck the next nigga too I give a fuck who's number two Long as I get my own It's a Friday night, so let me slide by Christie. Swoop up like Frisbees, two damn freaks for me and MC. Sucked up game, pursued my road. And slid to a few they never viewed before. Let's drink Crystal and hop in the pool. Conversate about the real, not fake, and keep it cool. I see you smiling, girl, what you smiling for? Looking sexy with your Cali buck wild flow. You like our jelly, you like what he produced through. Well, yeah, I like the bump and grind, you feel me? Conversating, not tripping where my hands at. Now she's relaxing, wanna tell me how her man act. Excuse me, but do your man got my number, baby? Cause I'm up from your house with your coat, keep on paging me. Hey, yo, ham, you know these digits. What's up, Mike, so? It ain't nothing but a man. Now, ain't that wicked? It ain't nothing but a damn shame. And no. it's very strange that my page will be the same thing. So, your man and your man must be trying to find clues on us and where we be. But we ain't tripping, let's give them a call so they can look for us and clean up after the dogs. Feel me? Call them up, now you tell them he can come through. But he can't be a pack in the food. After that, he never heard from us. And when he arrived, it read too late, player. Do not disturb us. We feel you. player too late player i'm gone and i got your woman with me damn that's cold man they're ruthless there's no guy code when it comes to that man damn and you know each one of them kind of had a little story about you know how it goes down man one girl when it comes to mc hammer she got to go to the pp or whatever and then she rolls up on him and and then he's like hey you with me now boom we're gone too late player, sorry, bye-bye, we gone. Um, next dude's at a table, and they're drinking Heineken, and then these these players got um, Chris Dahl, and she's like looking over at the next table, and that's it, man, she, she's she gone. <laughs> that's cold, man, and that's how they do it, man. Damn, there ain't no guy cold in that. But, man, I saw pictures of two. He was with some beautiful women, man. Damn. I, I Man, I wish Tupac would have had a kid, man. A son, an heir, uh, you know, a daughter. You know, some people say that he's, like, got the long-lost missing son. Why didn't he ever have a kid, damn it? He needed to, man. I mean, it would have been perfect. If he knew he was going to die, why wouldn't he have an heir? Why wouldn't he do that? Can he not have kids? I don't know, man. It's that's, It's weird. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe he did get his nut shot. I don't know. I'm just saying, man, I don't know. Maybe he couldn't have kids after that. Because, you know, a lot of people say he did shoot himself in the nuts. Not that I've ever checked or seen any pictures thereof. I'm just saying. So, even though his daddy's like, no, man, he showed me when I just met him, you know, like 30 minutes earlier at the hospital, yeah, that's my boy because he's got a big package, you know. That was bullshit. Have y'all seen that interview? I played that one time. That was bullshit. All right, man. I'll see y'all later. Why am I rambling? Because I can. All right. I'll see y'all later. Peace out, y'all. I said peace out. Peace out. 
Man, I think somebody said the other day, man, you're getting blacker and blacker as the videos go by. What's up with that, man? Am I transitioning? I know some people also said, man, I got like four black cards coming. I'm invited to all the barbecues. You know, damn, I'm going to be like the the white cool dude. I did. They did call me white chocolate back in the day, man, when I was shooting the hoop. So, you know, I know, I know what's up on that end. So, all right, y'all. I don't know what's wrong with me. Check this out, guys. My boss man said that we could actually give you a thousand dollars, and this is how. All right, y'all. TCB, the country boy. I want to give y'all a little update real quick. Um, you know, I've been posting some stuff at the end of these things, and I let you guys know that I did real estate. And man, you guys really came up strong, man. So strong. I got to make some changes because so many people have sent me information. Um, as far as vacant properties in their neighborhood it's just way too much stuff man dang i can't even keep up but so my boss man said look here we got to make a change but i'm gonna make it better so here's the deal anywhere in the united states if you guys know of somebody who has a property that they want to get rid of it's got to be a single family regular house um in a decent livable neighborhood and it's a basically a decent conditioned property it can't have no big old hole in the roof and you know water flying in and and mold damage everywhere or a burned out kind of a thing and it's got to be a decent or almost in decent livable condition and if we end up buying that house i tell you what we'll do we'll give you a thousand dollars just for giving us the hookup if we buy it that's it man simple as that thousand dollars in your pocket man damn that's it anywhere in the continental u.s so that's the deal man i appreciate y'all Man, we got so many people that sent me over houses, I couldn't even keep up, man. Damn, be careful what you wish for, because sometimes it will come in the form of a tidal wave. And that's what happened, y'all. So, there we go, man. I appreciate y'all so much. Let's keep this bad boy going. All right, y'all. I'm going to give you my email address real quick, which is also on the About page. So, if y'all know of any houses, or y'all have family members that have houses, or hell, if you've got houses, you can deal with me, man. We'll hook it up, man. All right, so... Let's get on to this fun stuff, then we can get we can do some business and some fun at the same time. So there you go, y'all. I appreciate it.